I don't want to hate people, they make me hate them. <laughs> I'm all about love, you feel that immediately with me. But I was on the airplane coming here, a woman in the seat behind me, she gets up and she starts spritzing cinnamon. I go, lady, what are you doing? She goes, well, it's natural. I go, so is my butt, but I'm not putting it in your face. I didn't want to hate her. She made me hate her. Do you see what's happening there? Yes. I'm a victim. I had a car accident recently. I'm all right. Don't worry. <laughs> Young guy, stoned out of his mind, on his cell phone, music blaring, looked a lot like you. <laughs> Gets out of his car, you know, with the man bun. Dude, I don't know what happened, dude. I'm like, oh, what happened is in 1999, your mother forgot her birth control. <laughs> Dude. Well, I, let him I didn't want to say that. He made me say it. I was a victim. I was victimized. Okay, so but truth be told, I am at that age post-period pre-death. That's, that's my age range. Here it is. I don't want to be a cougar. Absolutely not. I don't need some young hot guy named Chad <laughs> touching my belly fat going, ooh, what's this? <laughs> What's this? This is rage. Rage. Covered by affordable treats and wine from Trader Joe's. That's what this is. We got going here, baby. Yeah. Yes. Yes. You know what I want? This is what I want. I want a guy around 86 years old. Where I am the hottest thing between him and death. He can't believe he got me because he knows he'll never get anyone better to the day he dies. <laughs> and he's not looking over his shoulder for somebody younger and hotter. You know why? He has arthritis in his neck. He can't move his neck. <laughs> and he sees none of my flaws. He sees no cellulite, belly fat, varicose veins. Why? Cataracts. Cataracts. And you know what? Let me tell you something. I love him. And I look into his milky white eyes. <laughs> and I say, I love you! Because he's hard of hearing and I want him to know. Because I'm all about love. Thanks, you guys. I'm Maureen Langan. <laughs> a lot, you guys. Thank you so much. You're funny, Maureen. <laughs> it's the timing. You just have this really good timing Thank and you. your voice and how you just like, bam, 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 bam. You just have the next one coming and the next one coming. I mean, I was laughing a lot. So were you. So were you. Yeah, well, everybody was. Why are you laughing, Simon? So funny, so fearless. That's what Simon says. Thank you. What about you, Sophia? It was fascinating. Your energy, the way that you control the stage, the, you, you didn't miss one beat. You yeah. know your material. She has, like, the body. She was so tired. Yeah. You feel like you need to be, like, on a TV show, actually. Thank you. Yeah, you, you know, you have a voice where we can hear you and we can hear your mm -hmm. rhythm and we can hear your attitude and we love it and we connect with it. I think people not only are gonna love you, they will imitate you, they'll wanna see you. You have catchphrases, yes. you have everything in that arsenal that a, a great comedian needs. You are ready to explode. Thank you. I wanted to love you and I did love you. I'm going to give you a first yes. You were fantastic. Second yes. Sophia. I think people are going to love you. Yes. Simon. Four yeses. Four yeses. Super funny. She really nailed it. I love when funny works. You were fantastic. Oh. Just touches your soul. I oh, mean, you know. Oh my God! You, you, you could literally drop the mic. The people were all over this. 